Welcome to our unit on Firebase. Uh, if you're watching this video, uh, you've probably already completed all the work that we're going to be doing on UI design. So I'm going to assume that you are a master of activities and fragments and menus and dialogues, or at least that you're on your way to becoming a master. So uh, what we have going on in this unit uh, is, to, um, is to play around with Firebase, right? Um, so let's talk about our app that we're going to make first, uh, and then we'll dig into some details here. Um, so let's see. So here is my app, and what I also have is a um, what's called the Firebase Forge. Right. So this is uh, we have we have this stored online uh, in a Firebase. Uh, so what I have is is a thing for for movie quotes here. Uh, so the the movie quotes um, that I have on my device running right now are the same as you can see they're they're synced up here they're in opposite order and that's that's purposeful just the way that I designed the app here uh, so what I could do is I could delete one of these so I'm gonna go ahead and long press on one uh, and we see that that deletes from the back end here in real time happening instantly um, I can go ahead and I can add that back in here so I'm going to add uh, the quote again I'll add the same one so I am your father of course everyone knows that that is from uh, from the Empire Strikes Back um, Vader's famous revelation to Luke so all right the Empire Strikes Back so I'll click OK and we'll see that that's going to generate as soon as as I created it here uh, you saw that that made on, on the back end um, and let's do an edit this is this is pretty impressive here in fact it's uh, because of the delay in my um, in my uh, my software here that shows my phone on my screen, it's actually going to uh, update faster on the Firebase backend than it is. Then you're going to see it come up on the screen here, but it's pretty much instantaneously. So L U K E, right? And yeah, you can see that that it's 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 updating here pretty much instantaneously, right? So I can, I mean, crazy, right? How fast it works. Uh, so in the unit, um, obviously we're going to be learning how to how to use Firebase here. Uh, so let's let's give uh, credit where it's due. Um, so most of these slides uh, were created by by Tyler Rockwood uh, during an independent study course. Um, so you're going to see Ty Tyler's username show up in a whole bunch of places, and and that's why. Uh, so good stuff there. Uh, and just the the goals for the unit. Uh, what we're going to be looking to do is to um, connect an Android client. To a Firebase database backend, so we'll be working enough with the backend to, to understand at least how to set things up. Uh, we'll actually give you a web interface as well. Uh, we're going to create Firebase objects. We're going to implement listeners to receive data, uh, and then um, when we receive it, we're going to be receiving JSON data. So we're going to have to figure out how to get that into Java classes. And it turns out that if we that if we play along with the Firebase format, uh, it's going to be almost trivial to do. They they make it very nice for us. Uh, and also going in the other direction, um, we want our client to be able to modify data, so be able to push things to the Firebase. Uh, so we're going the other direction. So given a job object, can I turn that into JSON data? Uh, and then can I implement the CRUD methods, right? So you probably heard of CRUD, so as an acronym for create, read, update, and delete. And those are the kind of things that we're gonna wanna be doing uh, with our movie quotes. Uh, so come back uh, for next time uh, when we learn what is Firebase. Thank you.